Hi, I'm Elizabeth and I'm Cindy and we're here with another feeding frenzy for the master key system and we are going to finish up part three with questions. Yes. I bet you have questions, oh, have don't you? Many, many questions. Many questions. Okay. All right. Let me find them. Okay. What system of nerves is the organ of the conscious mind? Conscious the mind. conscious mind. Well, the subconscious. Now you threw it in. Mm -hmm. in a system of <clears throat> nerves that makes up the conscious mind. Give me a hint. Okay. Cerebro spinal. Cerebro spinal. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> well, I was just going to say brain, but I knew it was more than that. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking, I can't remember if it involved the spine or not. But yes, I guess it does, doesn't it? It's cerebro and spinal. So I guess it's the brain and, and the, spine. the spinal cord. Spinal cord. <coughs> All the spinal nerves, yeah. Okay, what system of nerves is the organ of the subconscious mind? Solar plexus. Well, they're saying the sympathetic. The sympathetic, yes, which is located within the solar plexus. Got that. Okay. So what is the central point of distribution for energy, which the body is constantly generating? <laughs> solar plexus! It's finally an answer! <laughs> ding, ding, ding! It's finally B! So what is B. the difference in the solar plexus and the sympathetic nervous system? Well, it's the other part of the nervous system. You have the nervous system. <laughs> <laughs> In other words, I you don't, don't know. know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't always know. Okay. <laughs> how, may, how may this distribution be interrupted? I'll put you in the gut. Let's see. <laughs> <clears throat> By resistant, critical, discordant thoughts. Okay. I don't know why you couldn't say that. Well, me either. But especially... Well, I'm beating up on myself. But especially... My loose touch the of word. Fear. Oh, that's not the one I was thinking about. <laughs> I'm sure they're thinking, I don't remember reading that. <laughs> How may this be interrupted? It's fear. It's fear. Fear, fear is the way of everything. Yeah. When not that, the when other one. When you're in doubt, if it's a negative thing, just pick fear. Okay, what is the result of such an interruption? Loss of connection, loss of signal. <laughs> Every Wi Fi goes out. Every ill with which the human race is afflicted. I get an affliction. <coughs> Fear gets blamed for all of it. <clears throat> How may this energy be controlled and directed? Change my thoughts. <gasps> Conscious thought. Oh my gosh. Call me Schwami. You got two right out of. <laughs> Hey, I was only shooting for one, so I'm doing good. How may fear be completely eliminated? That's a good question. That is a good question. When you reprogram the subconscious with the conscious, the positive conscious thoughts, well, once you get into touch with your solar plexus and realize the power within, <gasps> keep so going, you didn't wait. There. You didn't wait long enough. <laughs> By an understanding and recognition. You didn't wait, I wasn't finished. <laughs> you understand your power. And recognition of the true source of oh, all power. But you can finish. <laughs> what determines the experiences with which we meet in life? Our attitude. Very good, our predominant oh. Oh, mental oh, attitude. I got that one. How may we awake the solar plexus? Do not scream at it. Well, if you do like God did this morning. <laughs> <laughs> that big thing of bolt of lightning thunder. That awoke everything. It <laughs> rang my bell. It did. did. <laughs> it was very loud. <clears throat> Mentally concentrate upon the condition which we desire to see. Let's <laughs> <laughs> say go to the bathroom. Mentally concentrate. <laughs> Sometimes it takes place in there, too. <laughs> oh, my goodness. What is the creative principle? <laughs> You're going to hate yourself when you roll the sack. <laughs> what is the creative principle of the universe? Oh, come on. The law of attraction. Oh, come on. The creative principle. Yeah. What creates everything? My thoughts. Universal mind. Yeah. Yeah. Which is in touch That's with it. it. Those were hard. You yeah. didn't even let me read them beforehand. I know. You didn't give me time to... You did. It's fairly good. <laughs> you concentrated good. thinking. <laughs> I'm afraid you're going to fart on me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid I was going to hear 
your concentration. <laughs> I can smell it. That's awful. That's really awful. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to awaken your solar plexus. <laughs> All right, so we're done with part three. We are done with part three. It's, I didn't learn more, yeah. even though the questions were kind of <clears throat> tricky. Yeah. So what'd you think about part three? I really, I'm really, no, it was informative for me. <coughs> All kidding aside, you know, I didn't have any idea about this solar plexus. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of cool to be able to give that gut reaction a name. Uh, you know, to know exactly that um, there's a science there and not just a guess. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Does it make sense? Mm -hmm. Not just a woo-woo kind of airy-fairy thinking. It's really it cool when I, when I can <coughs> when I can see science um, catching up with you know spiritual thoughts mm -hmm. and see wow it really does come together. So that's what this chapter did for me. Yeah. It brought the two together really well. Good. What about you? Me too. Yeah. Um, I don't know what part four is about, but we're gonna find out tomorrow. Hey, it's gonna be good stuff. It is gonna be really good stuff, like part three. Anyway. All right, you concentrate your thinking. <laughs> Shrink. Shrink.